morning everyone today is wednesday we are starting our day outside because it is such a beautiful morning i don't even think you can tell like and it's just gorgeous so yeah we're starting our day outside um i thought i'd vlog today i've not got anything particularly exciting on but i've got a few errands to run and <laughs> bits and bobs so i thought i'll bring you along with me look at the standing girl all by oh now you're leaning all by yourself huh she take yeah She'll take like two or three steps, but she just won't walk. But she loves this thing. Also, I did my nails the other day and I did them Christmas Eve because I'm super excited for Christmas this year because it's her first, like, it's her second Christmas, but her first Christmas she can actually like do things and be ex like open things. So I'm so excited, but I'm very aware it's only November. So I was like the bare minimum. I can paint my nails Christmas Eve and get excited about it. Um, also, I'm so excited. I have some more strawberries coming. I think I showed you in one of my last vlogs. I don't know the last time I vlogged. Um, but we've got strawberries and tomatoes and I'm so excited. We had loads, but they all got eaten. So we ended up like putting this thing in there. Uh, this is actually Anita's old frame, um, like play gym but we did that and then this is our old bath which is meant to be being picked up today but I don't know what's happening with that anyway so yeah there's like strawberries there's loads of them like they're everywhere but all the red ones got eaten which was so sad it was sad yeah this is a baby that should be napping this is a baby that's not napping and it is instead taking her clothes off mummy have it mummy put them back on thank you Mummy, mummy, put them on. <laughs> okay. Okay, I've got to vlog quickly whilst I get ready. I look insane. My skin is playing out quite badly at the moment. I don't think my psoriasis is something I've actually talked about on my YouTube before. Um, I have stress induced. Please ignore my child crying. I've just put it down for a nap. <laughs> it's just Um, I have stress induced psoriasis. I was diagnosed with it probably six months ago, maybe not, maybe a little bit less than that. Um, I had eczema growing up as a kid, I've always had eczema, um, but I have monitors here before anyone thinks I'm neglecting my child. I had eczema growing up, not badly, but like enough, um, I had creams for it and stuff. And it was something I kind of grew out of. I've always had it on my hands. It's never gone away on my hands. Um, I think because I'm such like a germaphobe, I wash my hands a lot. I sanitize my hands a lot. Um, so the skin on my hands is just very dry as it is. Um, but yeah, a few months ago, I started getting little spots all over my body. Um, and when I finally went to speak to my doctor about it, she says, um, she thought it was psoriasis. We did some skin swab, scrape things. And that is indeed what it is. So makeup wise, I can't put foundation on my face at the moment because it's playing up on my skin a little bit on my face. I don't normally get it on my face. It's normally very much just all over my body and my scalp. I struggle quite badly with the psoriasis on my scalp. Um, I have a few things. I have a shampoo I use and I also have this spray, which has actually been quite good. Um, I put it in when my hair's wet. I'll do that just before I blow dry it. Um, and that's definitely helped as well. But yeah, it's on my face. So um, for makeup today, I'm not gonna be doing foundation. I'm just gonna do concealer, bronzer, all that lot like around it. Um, so yeah, that's been fun. It's definitely something that has knocked my confidence quite a bit. I have always been quite self-conscious, self I think. Um, I trigger warning. Um, struggled with an eating disorder for seven years of my teenage years from the age of 11 to 18. Um, so my body is something I've always been quite self-conscious about and I'm not going to get deeper into the eating disorder thing because that's very personal. But I had finally got to a place where I was quite confident with my body post baby. She's really screaming. Um, and then yeah, my body decided that psoriasis was the way to go. And that's definitely something that has knocked my self-confidence um, quite a bit. I think because I just obviously don't like the way it looks. 
um it's very itchy as well which is means that it's like i'm constantly reminded of it i can constantly feel it i can constantly i'm constantly uncomfortable which obviously does not help at all and makes the situation feel a whole lot worse than it is what am i rambling on about today today's plan i think i said earlier today is like an errands running day i need to go to the supermarket to get anita food like snacks and stuff because she's running low but i think what i'm actually gonna do is go out to the chemist warehouse because they have a lot of like kid snacks and stuff in the baby aisle so um and they're a lot cheaper than the supermarket so i'm gonna go there shoe shopping that's really where i was going with that so yeah that is today's plan i also need to go and take my mum's birthday present i have bought her a ring a diamond ring because that's what she's asked for it's her 50th birthday on the 2nd of december so coming up super close super clone super soon and i've got the ring the ring is here but I made her try on some of my rings so I know what size to ask them to get the size to. So I need to do that. She is also finally asleep. <laughs> She's there. <laughs> my outfit for today is, as per usual, all from Cotton On Body. I feel like every time I film, I'm wearing Cotton On Body. But um, I just have this black jumpery thing that ties up. And then my comfy little... Um, Flared, that's what I'm looking for, flared pants. So yeah, that is my outfit for today. We are not a happy baby to wake up, huh? You did good, not nice. She just woke up, so I'm gonna make her a bottle and then lunch and then we'll head out after. Okay, change of plans. I've decided we're actually gonna go out for lunch and have a little mummy daughter date. Um, so she's just having some popcorn as a snack and then we will go out to the valley and probably get um, some lunch at a little cafe there. Also, these are the shoes that she has. They're on the table, which is not good. Um, these are the ones she's gonna wear today. Brand new. I bought these when I was pregnant. Um, so they're a UK for US five. They are a size bigger than these ones. What are these ones? What are these? Oh, these are a US four. Mm, okay, I'm gonna see if these fit her, but I don't think they will. If not, then these are the only shoes she has. These are little vans. I bought them for her um, just after last Christmas. So I'm obsessed with these. They're so cute. She does also have her Crocs as well, but obviously they're not like the easiest everyday wear. So um, she doesn't wear them too often. This bow is going to be the closest to match the color of her shoes. This is awful. This is disgusting. <gasps> My pretty girl. They actually match quite well. Are you so pretty? She's just eating some popcorn. I'm still into you. Okay, I just dropped some stuff off at the donation like site for our local hospice shop. Um, so they were just a bunch of my clothes and Anita's clothes that don't fit anymore or that I don't wear. Um, and some shoes and stuff that people can obviously get better use of than me. Anyway, out to the belly now. We're going to get lunch first. It's 12 now, so we'll get lunch first. And then um, we will do the shoes probably because I want to do that while she's still happy so I can try them on her. Um, and then we'll go to the chemist warehouse to grab bits and bobs. Are you the cutest lunch day? Yeah, are you the cutest lunch day? Are you wiping your face? Can you wipe your face? Can you wipe your face? Wipe your face? Good girl. Love a girl. Do you love a good cheese and garlic now? Oh. You over right now? I also got a bib, so she's got a napkin. Do you want it? You done? No, you done with that bit? They don't have them in white, but they have them in black, and the black's kind of cute. Mm. Possibly. They also have these ones, which are really cute, but again, like I just want white. But I guess these would go with them still, too. 
Do you like those ones? You're smiling. They got a label on them, huh? These ones are kind of cute. I think they might get these ones compared to the black. I wish they had the black ones and white because I really like the way the black ones look. But I don't think I'd use the black ones much. Which is annoying. More lemon dummies because the bloody dog keeps staying with them. And so we have none, but I'm trying to figure out which ones I want. Because I'm that mum. They don't have the white ones that I normally get. Are you kidding me? These are the cutest things ever and I want them. Right, I'm going into one of the shops to look for bits for my mum's birthday setup. I think they also have the Christmas stuff, so I'm extra excited. Stop. Okay, I'm quickly off to the supermarket. Anita is at home with my mum. Um, we have people coming over for dinner tonight, so I just need to grab some bits and bobs, which is super easy. Um, so yeah, that's where I'm going now. Once we get home, I will show you the bits and bobs that I bought today, even though I've kind of already shown you. Um, it wasn't anything exciting other than her shoes. Um, I got two pairs. I got a little yellow pair and um, the rainbow pair. And then I just want white. So now she has pink that the pink vans those really cute little rainbow pastel they're really pastel rainbow so like they're light and easy like they'll go with everything um and a cute little pastel yellow pair they were both on sale for 20 dollars each so i was like yep 40 bucks for two pairs of shoes proper shoes like don't mind if i do um so yeah i i don't know harry my brother asked what to get her for christmas and i said shoes so i'll just ask him if he can please get her a white pair um I think will be the easiest and then yeah I just grabbed some food bits and some dummies and um, a drink a new drink bottle for her from the chemist warehouse and then I went and got some bits for my mum for her birthday um, I just got some balloons and stuff to set up I am the worst I any event or any occasion I will make into an event um, I love birthdays I love Christmases I love Mother's Days I love all of that sort of stuff um, so yeah I'm super excited to set that up for her um, like I said it's not until December the start of December but December so that gives me enough time to sort some bits out which is good um so yeah that's that We just have she's already eaten most of it um chicken and pasta with vegetables as well so that looks really foul actually <laughs> but she loves it yay yum good girl good job more okay yummy